Peace out, Phoenix. Phoenix is officially in the rearview mirror. I am starting my journey back to Seattle. Just like that, four months, boom, gone. It's insane that four months has already passed and now I'm heading home to Seattle. Unbelievable. This car is packed to the brim right now. If you guys watched my video four months ago on YouTube of my journey down to Phoenix, everything I packed in that video, I had to repack again into this car for this journey home. So it's been crazy. But naturally, I will be sightseeing on my way home. So first stop on the journey home is Joshua Tree National Park. Let's go explore out there. Let's start this journey home to Seattle. In case you wonder what it looks like between Phoenix and Joshua Tree, that's what it looks like. <laughs> Absolutely nothing. Just the middle of nowhere abyss. <laughs> in Joshua Tree National Park. You know the first thing we had to do is get a sticker for the collection. This will be home for the night. Let's go explore a little bit. Let's go explore Joshua Tree. First trail of Joshua Tree, Split Rock Loop. Let's check it out. I need some coffee right now.
Cheers. So we were all packed up and that would do it for Cottonwood Campground. It was a beautiful, beautiful night last night. The stars were insane. Joshua Tree has such beautiful sunsets and stars. It was an incredible night last night. And we're gonna go exploring today throughout the park. And tonight we'll be staying at Ryan Campground, which is on the other side of the park, it's like 40 miles away. Let's get to exploring. This is home for the night. So just got the campsite set up. I don't know if you can really see that, but got my stuff on the table. This campsite has some really close neighbors. <laughs> the sites are like right next to each other, but now I'm drinking some electrolyte water because I think I'm gonna go for a hike and it's blistering hot outside. So gotta make sure I'm hydrated first and then we will set foot on the trail, get some views. Let's go on this hike. We're gonna go up to the top of that. Let's get after it. Since it's so warm out, I think I'm gonna go tarps off, so gotta put on the sunscreen. <laughs> Right, we are off onto the trail. I love hiking in the desert. Just the sunshine, man. It feels so good. And look how beautiful this trail is. Oh my gosh. So we just came up all of this. Beautiful views. And I think we're close to the top, somewhere up here, so. so rad up here but it's so windy you guys probably can't even hear me right down there is my campground I'm, i'll be sleeping down there tonight Okay, time to run back down this mountain.
Well, I didn't die, so I must have done something right. <laughs> Bye, mountain. Okay, success. Let's go see what else we can find. This is incredible. So, so rad. We're out here getting some sizzlers. Well, you can't even see it, but trust me. This place is incredible. It's hard for me to put into words how beautiful this place is. It's so aesthetic. And these Joshua trees are so unique. It's just it's so fun to explore here. It's like a playground for adults out here. <laughs> Spectacular. <laughs> so just finished getting a bunch of photos and videos. And now we just wait for sunset. I think this will be a sick sunset spot. So we got about an hour and a half until sunset so I'm just gonna wait it out come back out here get some sizzlers <laughs> so this is where I'm gonna be waiting for sunset and getting some some food snacks <laughs> this is epic I squeeze. What is this? Like I said, it's like a dull playground. <laughs> uh. My car's over there. This is just where I get to sit and wait for sunset. Like it's. Even the sitting and waiting part's epic. <laughs> yeah, I think this would be a six on that spot. <laughs> That's the mountain we're up on earlier, Ryan Mountain. We we're up there earlier today. All right, but I'm getting hungry, so let's get some food and wait for this sunset, man. It's gonna be epic. Oh. All right, back through the hole we go. Uh, uh, uh. Back to the slot we go. Uh, uh. <laughs> All right, for my snack gonna boil some water and eat my trusty protein oatmeal <laughs> I love this stuff and then waiting for sunset this is the new book that I just started reading so we're reading a little bit from this have some oatmeal 
Wait for sunset. Cheers. It's just so nice out here right now. Sun setting, hitting the hills in the background. So, so beautiful. And then this right here, look at this. This little peak back here, just getting sun kissed. Here's some of the photos I'll show you. It's kind of hard to see it, but it's gonna be so nice. <laughs> it's brilliant right now. So now, now that the sun is kind of done hitting these peaks, I'm just gonna wait until it finally goes fully down and then it should just light all this up with just purple, pink, orange. That's what happened last night at least. So hopefully it does that again and then I'll get some shots of that as well. We'll call it a good night. Just pitch the chair out here. And uh, Waiting for the sun to officially go down. <laughs> this is just unreal out here, I love it, it's awesome. It was a successful sunset mission. It's starting to get dark now, so I'm gonna make my way back to the campsite, start the fire, and have yet another night of amazing stargazing. So let's get back to the campsite. Home sweet home. Good morning. Let's make some coffee.
Cheers. Joshua Tree, thanks for having me. My time here at Joshua Tree has officially come to an end. It is time to continue heading north. So that'll be the end of this episode here at Joshua Tree. As always, thank you guys for watching. I appreciate you all so, so much. And uh, tune in to the next video because I'll be documenting my journey north. And I'll be documenting my next destination, which will be Sequoia National Park. So tune into the next video to see my adventures there at Sequoia's. As for this episode, thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next one as I continue to head.